Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. My name is Kenzie. If you did not know that, then now you know and you guys today I'm going to be doing my July favorites. If this is your first time ever seeing me, then hello, I'm so happy to have you. My name is Kenzie. I make a lot of videos about luxury handbags, luxury fashion, travel, jewelry, but mostly handbags. I like those a lot, but today we're doing a favorites video. If any of that sounds fun to you, if you like the idea, then I would ask you to consider clicking the subscribe button and give this video a like and ding a little bell down there so you're notified every time I upload. And you guys, without any further ado, let's get on into the video. So yes, it's been quite some time since I've done a favorites video. I always forget to do favorites videos. And I was just thinking yesterday night, I was like, oh, I haven't done a favorites video in quite some time. And it is newly August. We're not too far into August for me to do a July favorites. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I have a loads of stuff to show you today. I have a handbag, of course. I have some beauty products, skincare. I have an accessory and then I have some clothing pieces as well. And then I have some really nice tech pieces that I cannot wait to share with you all. So let's just get into it. I think I'll start with the clothing pieces because I do have of the most of those i do have quite a few clothing pieces to show today not a ton i have like five <laughs> two of them are going to be hats i have been so into like hats and ball caps and stuff like that recently and to my knowledge i don't think that i have shown these on youtube or anything and i don't think i've shown them really on social media maybe i showed them on instagram i don't really remember the first one is going to be this one right here this one is from anina bing and it's this beautiful brown color and it says Brooklyn and then it says Anita Bing on the back right here. This one here is probably one of my favorite ball caps that I have because it just fits so well. Like it just goes on and that's it. Like that's all there is to it. it it's so easy. It fits very nicely. It's really comfy. I'm gonna mess up my hair. <laughs> but I love this one. I don't remember how much this is and I don't think it comes in sizes. And then I picked this one up from Mew Mew. This is actually my very first Mew Mew item ever. And if you can see, it does say Mew Mew on the front and it's kind of like this distressed black denim hat. I like this a lot and I actually got this in a size large because they do have sizes and that's all they had left was a large and then I just have it kind of fastened really tight back here so it's not too big on my head. I don't know how to size my head when it comes to hats like I'm sure you need to like measure it but like I don't know but yeah this one's really really nice as well it's very understated you can't really see the Mew Mew logo unless you like really look at it but I think it's nice and it goes with a lot of my stuff as you can see this one is far more structured than this one this one's very loose and very like floppy this one is definitely a lot more structured and holds its shape but I love both of them next up for clothing I have this bodysuit I actually have this in white and black but this is from Aritzia I I'm obsessed with this. I love this bodysuit so, so much. I feel like everybody and their mom has a bodysuit from Aritzia. And I do have one, but I have one that's um, like, it's like a tank top bodysuit kind of thing. But these ones are like square neck right here. And then they have long sleeves. I love this. I got this in a size small. It goes with everything. It's kind of like a staple, a definite basic, and it's a great basic to have in your wardrobe. And you can really just pair this with anything. You can wear it with jeans, shorts, like patterns, because this is very simple. Um, you can dress it up, dress it down. I love this bodysuit so, so much. Another clothing favorite, and I'm actually not sure if I've ever mentioned this in a favorites video. I hope not. If I have, I'm really sorry that I'm mentioning it again, but if I haven't, then here we are. But this right here is one of my favorite cardigans of all time. I know when you look at this, it doesn't really like scream my style, but I love it. This is from Zara. It's no longer available, sadly. Like I think this was like limited edition, but it's this beautiful dark green cardigan. And then it has these like little patches on it and it has like leaves and mushrooms and like all kinds of fall goodies on it. I love this so, so much. And I actually found this from Poshmark. I didn't get this from Zara. I saw somebody selling it on Poshmark and I was like, oh my God, I need that right now. So very, very happy with this purchase. I'll be wearing this so much during the fall. We're, we're already in August. So in my mind, fall has already started and I'm so excited about it. 
here's the back. And then my last clothing item, which is probably one of my favorite clothing items that I have in general, but I got these pants, you guys. I have not shown these on YouTube or anything yet. I did post a Instagram picture with me wearing these, but oh my God, I found these on Poshmark as well. And then they went to get verified and it turns out they, they are the real deal, which is amazing. These are Fendi pants. I believe Cassie Thorpe also has these pants. I didn't buy them because of Cassie. I do love them, but I have always wanted these pants, but I did not want to pay full price for these pants. So I found them on Poshmark. This girl was selling them for like more than half off retail price. So I snagged them. These are a size 40, which is literally perfect. And here's what they look like. They're the Fendi Suka print. I think that's how you say it. I'm not 100% sure. And then it has a pocket on the in the back that you can't use. Like I really wish you could use the pocket. Like it would be it would make these so much better if you could use the damn pocket, but you can't. But I still absolutely adore these shorts. I love them so much. They have a very thick drawstring right here. They fit so well. I love the cut of them as well. I wore these pants with my uh, Aritzia bodysuit, but in black. I love it. I love these pants so much. And the fact that I was able to get them for such a good price at my size, a done. I am just so happy that I have these pants. I'm obsessed with them. Those are all my clothing pieces. Um, I do have one accessory to show, so let me just go ahead and show that right now. These are my first ever pair of Celine sunglasses. I've wanted this style for quite some time. They are the Celine Triumph sunglasses. I hope if I put these on, it's not gonna destroy the camera the exposure but these are so freaking cool again they are the triumph sunglasses so they do have the triumph logo right there on either side i got these directly from celine because i had gone in the other day to show my essay my bag that i got and um he showed me these sunglasses and he said that th this color here had just come out and it's very hard to get your hands on and i had already wanted these sunglasses anyways but i was gonna get them in the tortoise shell but then i saw this colorway and I was like, oh my God, absolutely. I love this color. It's like this beautiful kind of light chocolate color, kind of like a milk chocolate color. It's beautiful. But yeah, it's just the typical Celine Triumph kind of oval sunglasses that you see all the time. But these are just in this beautiful colorway. I love these so much. And these are definitely gonna be a pair of my fall and winter sunglasses. I'm obsessed. Now let's get into some skincare items that I have been loving. First off, I'm not gonna talk your ear off too much about this because I know you're probably hearing a shit ton about it on TikTok and stuff like that. But this right here, the Cos RX Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence is actually really good. Again, I'm not gonna talk your ear off about it because I'm sure you've heard, but this is very, very good stuff. I love it a lot. I use a lot of it actually, but you can't really tell. I use two pumps nearly every single day and it doesn't look like I've used a lot. And this is very inexpensive. I get this from Amazon. You can get it from like Olive Young as well. I want to say it's like 10 bucks, 12 bucks, but I really do find that it genuinely helps my skin. It seems very hydrating. Again, I haven't finished it or anything, so maybe I'll give like an update once I like empty it, but so far I'm really enjoying this and I do think that it actually makes a difference in my skincare routine. Next up, I want to talk about this right here from Rode Beauty. This is the Glazing Milk. This is Rode's newest launch that they came out with like a month ago, two months ago, something. But I really, really like this stuff. I use this almost every day and it has this consistency that kind of looks like milk. That's why it's called the Glazing Milk. It's so hydrating. I usually use this after I put this on. I'll put on my toner and then I'll use this, and then I'll use this. And then then I'll use like something else and then like a moisturizer. But I have really been loving this. It feels fantastic on the skin. You can tell it's hydrating. So I've been really loving this. Last beauty product is gonna be this from Tower 28. I feel like every single person and their mom has talked about this from Tower 28. It is the Daily Rescue Facial Spray and it's just as good as people say it is. I love this stuff. I use this all the time. <laughs> I use it probably more than I pro I use it more than I should. I just spray it on. Like if 
your skin is feeling dry or if you've had your makeup on for a long time or if you're just like needing a little refresh, you just go pss, 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 and your skin just feels great. It feels very hydrating when, when you spray it on. It helps seriously soothe stressed out skin, which is very, very nice. I just use it whenever I feel like my skin is dry or just needs like a pick me up. That's all for the stuff that I can fit. Oh. I lied. I have a bag to show you. And if you have been on my channel for like the past couple of weeks, then you probably know exactly what bag I'm going to say. This is a brand new handbag and I know that I haven't had it for long enough to actually say if it's my favorite, but I know it's my favorite. Like it's already become I an everyday handbag. Like I have not worn any other handbag since I got this one. And it's my Celine Triumph. It's my Ava Triumph bag. I am enamored with this handbag. I am in love with it. This is one of my handbags of all time. One of my favorite bags that I currently have in my collection. I love it so, so much. She is absolutely stunning and beautiful. I did a full unboxing of this bag. So I will have it linked in the description if you haven't seen the unboxing yet. But yeah, I'm not gonna talk too much about this because I feel like I've already talked your ear off about her. I love her, she's perfect. I don't care that I can't crossbody her. She's one of the most comfortable shoulder bags that I have in my collection, probably the most comfortable shoulder bag. I can fit everything that I need to in here. She is like not small, but she's not huge either, but I do not need to worry about like condensing down my items or anything like that when I pack her. She is just perfect. I love her so much and that's it. I'm obsessed and she is definitely one of my favorite handbags that I have in my collection. But that is going to be everything that I can physically show you. Um, now I'm going to do some b-roll and then just talk about the next few products. So next up on my list is going to be my ice machine. I love this ice machine. I got this for during Prime Day and I got it for like a pretty good discount off. I'm obsessed with this. It makes the best nugget ice and I use this for my iced coffees. I use this for like my drinks, my cocktails, water, you can use it for anything, but it is just beautiful. It is a nice ice machine that does not ruin the aesthetic. I have seen other types of ice machines on the market and they're just like ugly and they're not cute or they're too small and don't make enough ice or they're too big and you can't put them on your countertop. This is a literal perfect in between. They also have this in black if you're wanting it in black. It's just perfect. I love it. I haven't had any issues. I have cleaned this a couple of times already as well and it's pretty easy to clean. Um, so yeah, I'm obsessed. I love this ice machine. I'll have it linked in my Amazon storefront if you do want to take a look and check it out. Next up, right next to the ice machine, I do have a brand new Nespresso machine, which is the Nespresso Virtual Pop. <laughs> I love doing that pop. I don't know. But yeah, it's the Nespresso Virtual Pop and it's their newest addition to the Virtuo Next line, I guess. But I found this at Target. I really wanted to try it out and I actually really like it. The only thing that I don't like about it is the opening thing. The Virtuo Next, the one that I had previous, is like an automatic open and close when, and this doesn't do that and I don't know why. You have to manually open and close it, which kind of sucks, but that's it. I love this color. It's so, so cute. It's very small. So if you are somebody that has limited counter space or if you need like a smaller footprint, then this is a perfect machine. Everything about it is pretty small. The water reservoir is very small as well. And then the little container that holds your used pods is a lot smaller. So it is a downsize, not in quality, but it is a downsize in how small it is. So if you needed something bigger, then I would go with like a Virtuo, regular Virtuo Next machine or the Virtuo Plus. But I really like this. The coffee's great in my opinion, and I think it's adorable. I love this blue color. You guys, that is everything that I have to share today that is on my favorites. But let me know in the comments what you thought of this video. Let me know if there's anything that I showed today that you also have in your collection that you're also loving. Let me know in the comments as well some things that you are also obsessed with and loving like that you're loving for August or that you loved for July. Just let me comment down below telling me anything because I'm nosy and I want to know that. But you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you did enjoy it. If you did, then go ahead and click up the like button for me and the subscribe if you want to. And be sure to ding a little bell down there so you're notified every time I upload. And you guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!